Hello, my name is Tu Pham and I am the Interim Nursing Director at Cypress College. Today, our medical surgical student will go through a simulation activity. So I want to take a minute to explain to you what's simulations here at Cypress College. Usually we have different stations. So the first thing that students check in is the preparation stations. So when they go into this preparation, they will work with the instructor about a case study that we try to create that mimics the real case scenario in the hospital. So students have a chance to learn about the case, learn about the contents, learn about the interventions, learn about what they need to do, the prioritize of the plan of care before they go into the real simulation. And then after that, the student will move to the next station, which is where the instructor will instruct them about the role that the student will play in the simulation rooms. Either they are a nurse or they are a patient, or not patient, but patient family or they are an observer. Uh, so the student know exactly what role they are in before they go into the simulation. The uh, simulation coordinator will act as a oncoming nurse or outgoing nurse to give a report at the bedside to the two nursing student. So that two nursing student will get the report and then they will get familiar with the environment before they go into action. So after that, they will be acting out a real situations based on whatever they already prep ahead of time. So they know the case already. So they will act out the role of a nurse. So they have a chance to practice clinical decision makings, critical thinkings, uh, prioritize what they need to do and create a plan of care based on the case scenario, based on the condition of the patient that they have. So after all that simulation, the last step will be deep breathe. So this is very important because this is where the student learn what they're doing, why they're doing, and they learn it on their own. So the instructor is the one that just facilitates the debriefing section, it's not teaching or anything. Student will reflect on what's going on and then they will identify why they're doing what they're doing and they will learn what, what should they do different next time if they, they get into that case scenario, or that situation again. And that's practically overall what we do here called simulation activity at Cypress College Nursing.